Come walk with us on a snowy day through what some have said is one of the most beautiful spots in the United States. That's what the National Geographic magazine calls the Clifton Gorge here in southwest Ohio. It's taken eons for the Little Miami River to carve a twisting, churning stream through the rocks of this 255-acre park. This is also one of the few public parks in Ohio that allows rock climbers to practice their sport. Once there were 70,000 of these water-powered grist mills. Today, the Clifton Mill is one of a handful still operating, and this one is believed to be the largest left in the world. A miller still grinds corn, oats, and wheat into flour. The grinder operated by the waters of the Little Miami River. The mill is open for tours and houses a unique restaurant where breakfast is a specialty. I asked for a small order of pancakes, and this is what I got. They tell me the pancakes used to be even bigger. People couldn't put syrup on them. There were very innovative ways people were trying to figure out how to put syrup. They would run down over the plate. And local folks say be sure to try their oatmeal pie. They claim if you like oatmeal cookies, you'll love oatmeal pie. A few miles down the road is the town of Yellow Springs. Here you can spend the night in a mansion that once housed one of the early founders of Antioch College. The Morgan House Bed and Breakfast offers a comfortable room with breakfast at rates starting at $35 a night. Ben Young is the third generation of his family to call the cows for milking at what may be the last dairy in Ohio that owns and milks its own cows. They're also one of only two dairies in the state allowed to sell raw, unpasteurized milk. It's just the way cow make it. It's her natural food. It's much richer and tastes great. He says that's one of the reasons for the popularity of their dairy, which is open seven days a week, 24 hours a day. The other is a super rich ice cream that they make right here and sell. The ice cream with a taste that only exists in most people's memory. Yellow Springs can be reached by Interstate 71, then east and I-70 to U.S. Route 68 South. And best of all, 